Hi, Gabe. How are you? Hi, Nicole. I'm doing well. How about you? I'm good. We are like missing you so much and we're missing all the kids. So it's so good to see your face. Good to see you too. I miss you guys a lot too. I miss being at school and just seeing all the students. Um, of course, all the staff, but uh, we're taking one day at a time. So what are you doing these days? Well, I've been reassigned to patrol. Uh, we are working, uh, all the SROs are assisting um, patrol and uh, a few of us assigned to different schedules, uh, different days, and uh, just uh, being out there visible, helping patrol with any kind of calls coming in, uh, involving juveniles or anything like that. And uh, of course, just uh, making sure that everybody's staying safe, everybody's staying inside too. That helps us a lot. And uh, just trying to, like I told you before, staying healthy and uh, staying safe. So what advice do you have for kids that are home right now and they're probably getting sick of all the work that they have to do? What would you say to them? Oh, let's see. Exactly what I will tell my kids too. If you are getting a little bit of uh, cabin fever and you just tired of being inside and maybe you're starting to fight with your siblings or parents too much, just take a little time for yourself. Just go to, you know, part of some, somewhere in the house where you can just relax, listen to some music, write something down um just take a little break from everything else that is going on and um, something that actually has been helping me a lot as well is uh in that parent if um some of, one of the parents actually is looking at if the parents are looking at this that parent will know who she is but i got a little book a little notebook from the parent where um, she encouraged me to write things that i'm thankful for every single day and uh, that's something that we can look at just having trying to keep a positive mind a positive attitude in the middle of this craziness and uh, you know a lot of the things are really difficult but at the same time we have a lot of things um, good things happening to us and just be thankful uh, for whatever we can that's so nice uh so let me ask this what is probably the top few things that you miss the most about the kids at stem oh my goodness high fives smiles coming in um, just a special handshake that I have with a few of the students, of course, and, uh, and just walking around the halls, just uh, seeing everybody, just um, hanging out, uh, getting along, uh, getting in trouble, just a normal kind of trouble they get at school, um, and just having conversations with the staff and the students. That's one of the things I miss the most, for sure. Well, we definitely miss you a ton. It was so nice to have you as part of our admin stand-up this morning, and hopefully we get to see you again this week. But uh, I don't want to keep you because I know you're really busy. So <laughs> have a great rest of your day, and um, can't wait to see you. Thank you, Nicole, and I miss everyone from STEM too. And uh, just greetings to all of you. Stay safe, um, stay healthy, and if you see me out there just driving around or something, just make sure to wave by. Hi. Um, Keeping that distance, of course, you know, it's, it's important to, to follow the, uh, the, the orders and the regulations that we have right now, but um, I miss you guys and stay safe. All right, well, have a great day. Thank you, you too.